Come on, this way. So, they got one of these. With the might of chaos and order eternally battling, a balance between them must also be fought for. Here at the heart of the Nexus is where that happens. Drawing in the two primal forces. It's no good. I'm gonna have to ask. Scree! Questions, questions again. And if there's something I'd want you to ask, you never do. What, please? These symbols. Ah. I presume you have noticed this. Indeed, there is a remarkable similarity. They are identical, you lunk. Lewis drew the design for me just after we met. How come the symbol's all over the place here? I simply can't tell you. Can't or won't? It's branded on you, Jen, not me. I don't know everything. It's not branded, it's just a tattoo, goddammit. Lewis told me it was a ancient rune of protection. I just thought it looked cool. Where did Lewis see this symbol? It's very important. He wouldn't tell me. Oh, forget it. Everything else going on, that ain't gonna freak me out. Come on, little guy. entered the kingdom of Solom. Time stands still in the four realms connected to the Nexus. In this realm, it is eternal night. And let me guess. Uh, eternal winter? By nature, Solom is bleak of climate, but nothing too harsh for its people. The Ferai are strong and resourceful hunters. You say hunters? The worlds of Oblivion are each inhabited by a different race, and yes, the Ferai are fierce, sometimes brutal, but they are fundamentally good. You're going to meet a lot, lot worse, I assure you. Splendid. So I'll quite happily lead the way whenever you like. You hear those growls, Scree? That sounds like Malkai. They're primitive, territorial beasts. Huge teeth, fearsome claws, fond of the dark. Well, that's it. We ain't moving. Oh, no. I suspect they'd only be interested in devouring you. Oh, great. I doubt they'd find me too palatable. Sure. You don't look particularly tasty. Malkai are afraid of fire. I'll scout ahead, see if I can find anything. I'll stay here until you get back. 